In Nehemiah 4, we find Nehemiah and the Jews facing some major opposition to the rebuilding of the city wall. Nehemiah was a cupbearer turned wall builder and perhaps the world's best construction foreman to have ever lived. A man tasked with rebuilding Jerusalem's broken down walls. But even though his mission and his calling really to rebuild the wall was filled with obstacles, the way that Nehemiah responded to these challenges offers us wisdom for facing our own struggles. Nehemiah 4 verse 14 says, don't be afraid of the enemy. Remember the Lord who is great and glorious and fight for your brothers and sons, your daughters, your wives, and your homes. When struggles and opposition come, we must remember that the Lord is with us. He is great and glorious. This is not about physical battles or building walls, but about our faith journey, our calling, our mission. It's about the obstacles we face and the perseverance we need to overcome them. In Ephesians 6.12, we're reminded, for we are not fighting against flesh and blood enemies, but against evil rulers and authorities of the unseen world, against mighty powers in this dark world, and against evil spirits in the heavenly places. Nehemiah's story is not just about rebuilding the wall. It's about standing firm in faith, trusting God, and refusing to be rocked by the attacks of the enemy. We can learn from Nehemiah. We can remember that God is bigger than any problem. We can keep praying and not giving up because God is with us. Scripture tells us in 1 Corinthians 16, 13, be on guard, stand firm in the faith, be courageous, be strong. No matter what you're facing today, remember that God is there to help. Keep praying, keep going, and trust that God is with you. No matter what we're going through, we can face it with the strength that comes from God.